Well, it is Monday, and this week we get moving on a little DIY. Morgan Molitor from Construction to Style is here. The few painting hacks. Morgan, great to have yes, you with us this morning. You. So people love to paint, right? I mean, yeah. it's a great way to transform a room. And it's summer now, so everyone's doing painting projects. Sure. We just started painting the trim on our house, so that's probably going to take me the rest of this year to finish. <laughs> that's it's a big job. job. <laughs> For sure. That's yep. right. But you've come up with eight different things that people can do. Maybe little easy tips to make painting a little yep, bit easier. Absolutely. Yeah. So the first one we have is a lint roller. So no matter how hard you clean, nothing's worse than when you get some dust or hair onto your brush when you're doing trim or doors oh, or anything yeah. like that. So just using a lint roller to go over your floor before you actually start painting. Oh, interesting. Yeah. So get all that dust and everything out of there. Yep. And you have Makes Vaseline. Sense. Yep, Vaseline. So if you're doing any molding or anything where you don't want to get paint or if you're painting and you want to make sure you have a clean line, putting Vaseline onto the wall, going ahead and painting, and then you can just wipe the Vaseline clean. Really? Yeah. Instead of like tape, you, right. you would use a, a yep. Vaseline. Or if it's in like a huh, tight cool. area to get in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Vaseline does the job. We have some essential yep. oils. Next this one. is just to calm yourself. Before. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> because it's so stressful. Yes. For yes. sure. Um, painting can be really smelly. Um, mm. Like my husband, he always gets migraines when he paints. So just putting a couple, um, either purification or lavender, into your paint bucket, and then that takes away any of the smells. Put it right in the paint. paint. Yep, right in the paint. That's genius. And only do a couple, because if you do too many, then you'll probably. You have a different yes. aroma problem. <laughs> yeah, yes. absolutely. Yeah. All right, and you also brought this pail here. Yes. Well, the pail, um, so if you're going to. Paint the brushes at the end using a little bit of fabric softener, and it makes your brushes feel like brand new. Um, and then we also have some press and seal. So if you're um, at the end when you're um, getting everything done, right. putting a little bit of press and seal in between the cover and the lid, so and it doesn't way, stick. Shut. Right. Yep. So the next time you go to paint, you don't it's have to not sit locked. There and pry and, the thing. Right. Absolutely. Cool. And then we got here a painter's pad. So if you're getting into those hard to reach places, mm -hmm. like behind a toilet. Taking a painter's pad, duct taping it onto a paint stick. Really? Yeah. I down. love That's the painter's there. pad, yes. but sometimes, it, you know, the little handle it comes with isn't. Right. That doesn't do Doesn't any get you anywhere. Super simple. <laughs> Just use the stick. Cool. Yep, yep absolutely. And then here, um, if you're going to take a couple days um, off while you're painting a project, actually just taking saran wrap, putting it around your brushes, putting it in a Ziploc bag, throwing it in the freezer, and then the next time you go to paint, um, just take it out 10 to 15 minutes before you're painting, and you don't get all those little paint, you know, when you go back sure. and it dries a little bit, and then you have throw it in the freezer. Dry paint all over in your the walls. Freezer. And then thaw it before you. Yep, just 10 to 15 minutes, and you won't have any of that dry paint. I would paint never on your have thought to have all done right, that. Cool. Yes. And then lastly, if you're painting um, up a ladder, nothing's worse than when you're trying to carry either the paint bucket or the tray and trying to do that balancing act. So this actually just goes right onto your ladder. And then my favorite part about it is it has a magnetic strip, so you can just put the brush onto it and you don't um, oh, drop your Oh, look at that. Paint. Yeah, you just throw it right yeah. on there. And have there a PT. Morgan Molitor, so. Construction to Style. Yeah. Great tips. Thank you very much. Thank we you. appreciate and good it. Good luck with your trim. Thanks. That's <laughs> right. That's right. <laughs>
This, this is, for is hard. not to clean your bathroom, it's for something else. <laughs> yeah, hard to reach places, so behind the toilet when you're trying to paint behind there. I always the, wonder how people do that. I know. Because it is a really yeah, hard Yeah, you have to jam your brush down there, and this you can, it's a painter's pad, and just tape it to a back of a painting stick and put it down. Makes it go really quick. Yeah. All right, and our last few things <clears> we have. And so this is if you're taking a couple days to paint or a week, instead of wrapping it in saran wrap or washing it for hours, just putting it into a plastic bag, throwing it in the freezer, and then the next day when you go back to paint, taking out 10 to 15 minutes before you paint and okay. rolling it back on. Good to go. Yes. And then finally. Yes, if you're on a ladder, um, this painting box, bucket's awesome because then it latches right onto your ladder. You don't have to balance your tray or your paint. You've never pad. had any spills on the ladder before? No, it's awesome. Pouring out? And and then the best thing is it's magnetic here, so. Oh wow, that's yeah. so nice. Don't drop that. your brush into the paint pail okay. and have a painted brush. Well, Morgan, <laughs> thanks so much for coming in. Thank and you. Congratulations. Thank I know you you're much. really busy at home, but yes. she's well rested, guys, and that's all that matters. <laughs> that's it right. Is. Yes. That's right. The best uh, hack for painting after you've just had a baby is to call somebody. Else. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No kidding. You Absolutely. have totally earned that. For sure. <laughs> thanks, guys. I